Hey what's going on guys, my name's Nathan and welcome back to Snacks of Women. Now today I'm doing some different types of moshi. These are all from Taiwan. I have three different flavors here. I have this one which just says Moshi Koatia Uber Moshi. Hope I'm saying that right. And I have some Japanese style green tea. And then I have some peanut ones. Now I'm probably most intrigued about the peanut ones, but I don't know how that's gonna go. I mean it's the most recognizable flavor I've seen out of the three of them. Obviously I know green tea as well. But this is the one I'm gonna be most intrigued about, so I'll save this till last. I think I'm gonna start off with the green tea. I've never had mochi before, I don't know how it tastes, whether it's sweet or what, but like I said, these are all Taiwanese brands. This particular one is Bamboo House, I think. Yeah, it says Bamboo House up there. And it says made in Taiwan. You can see from the packaging it does almost look like a dessert, so I'm expecting it to be a little bit sweet. Okay, and these aren't individually wrapped, they're actually in like little cupcake sort of casings, and there's six of them in a box. Okay, so these are really soft as well. Like, this is almost going to fall apart in my hand. It's got flour on it, it's like completely covered in flour. Oh, it smells of green tea. I'm going to go ahead and take a bite, I think it is going to be sweet. Wow, it's chewy. You can see the green tea filling is inside there. Literally all this is is dough filled with green tea. Like you really can taste the dough. It's really chewy, like say you're baking or something, obviously you make dough, that's all this is. It's actually pretty good. I didn't really expect it to taste like this, but it is really good. It's not as sweet as I thought. Like I said, you just get the dough taste and the green tea inside and that's it. So yeah, the first one down, I'm really impressed with these. Next up, I'll try these purple ones. Like I said, it's just Moshi Kai Tia. And this is by Royal Family. So a different brand. Presumably they're gonna be very similar. I'm not sure what the taste is gonna be, like the flavor, but we'll have a look. Completely different packaging on this one. These are completely covered in orange. They have a lot more flavors of these from what I can remember. I got these from a Thai market. There's like a whole aisle just full of different flavors, so I just picked up some random ones. You know, it's the same sort of thing in the little cupcake case, and we just take it out. This one seems to have more of a sticky texture to it. Okay, there we go. Yeah, this one's really sticky. Okay, let's give this a try. Definitely some kind of fruit. It's got a weird aftertaste though. Don't think I prefer those to the green tea. Yeah, that one's strange. Yeah, I don't really like that taste. I'm not really sure what it's supposed to be. It's some kind of like flowery, fruity taste. But it's the aftertaste that you get that's kind of strange. It's like the dough that mixes with it, I think. But yeah, I don't like those ones. Okay, now I can finally try the peanut ones. Now, I, I'm guessing I'm going to like these ones. I like peanuts, so I'm assuming I'm going to like them. If you look at the front of these, it almost looks like it's got something on the actual dough. So I'm not sure if that's going to be a piece of the peanut or what. This is from the same brand as the last ones, Royal Family. So we've got the same similar packaging. And yeah, I definitely see those peanut shavings on top. It definitely smells like peanut. It's not as sticky as the last one either. Okay, let's give this a try. Okay, that's definitely peanut. Which we have peanut shavings outside, peanut butter on the inside. That one's good. So I'd say out of the three of them, the green tea one's definitely my favorite. It's the sweetest of the three. And it just seems to go well, the green tea, with the with the dough. The other two were okay, like the, the peanut one was decent because it was like a taste I was familiar with, obviously peanut butter. But there is a, a limit to how much peanut butter you should put on something and it was a bit too much for me, I think. 
It was a bit overpowering. And the other one was just not not my kind of flavor at all. But I would say get these ones. These are really good. If you like green tea, you'll definitely like these because it wasn't that overpowering either. I mean, if you look at the box, it looks like there's a lot of filling in there. But it's really not when you compare it to the, the dough because obviously dough has a distinct taste as well. But yeah, I was impressed with these. So that's going to for this video, guys. Please leave some suggestions in the comments below on food trunk to try in the future. Please remember to rate, comment, subscribe. Until next time, see ya.